Hey, this is just a little helper for everyone who had this blue screen here with ATI HDW76. This um, the the error message is page fold and non-page area. So you can Google that, you find some stuff, and I think it's not very clear. So always, if I get a blue screen, I use the following tool. It's called the blue screen view and it's on such a website so you need you need you really need you really need to um, use Google to find the blue screen view you just open download links you open here mostly 64 bit you just click that you open the file and then you can run the program immediately okay so now here you go it shows you the information the dump the dumps from the last blue screen. So my blue screen was exactly 20 minutes ago <laughs> and I was playing Contract Wars, it's a browser game. I was running Open Broadcaster, this Open Broadcaster software in the background. Ah, we may, maybe I was running, I was running 32 bit and there was also a problem, I should go for 64 four bit next time. Anyways, so this is also using resources and I was running Bandicam for recording the game screen. So, and the message said, let's go back to the this one. I have something with the ATI. And ATI, as I know, is a Radeon graphics card. And so I went to the alphabetic thing here and I saw here's the ATI HDW. You can double click it and then you get some more information. So I guess if you're not sure, or if, if you have another problem with the, with the, not related to the ATI, you might find pros online who can help you with that. But it helped me already a couple of times. Um, this is the dump file, so you get all the information of the problem. Bug check code, for example, this one is helpful in Google. If you enter this one and this one, you come much closer to your solution. So and for me, it's something with the kernel, Processor X, yeah, Windows Mini Dump, okay, okay. So, as I said, enter this and this, and it will help you. For me, what I just did now, because I saw already in the in the thing here, ATI, ATI HDW76, I know that this is, as you see here, product name AMD HD Audio Driver. And what I'm actually using at the moment is a sound card from Sound Blaster. So let me open my sound, my playback devices from the Windows menu. And here you see my voice with the Sound Blaster Play 2. The playback, now it's, I had this enabled AMD, AMD HDMI output. And I just disabled this one. You click right mouse button and you click you click disable and this is what I want to try I hope this will fix my problem if not I also installed the latest catalyst control center the latest software here from AMD ATI which is 15.20 etc so 15.2 uh, 20 15.20 before I had 14.3 or something, like from last year, October. And if I will I will write this in the comments after one week if I had the blue screen again or not. Because if I have a blue screen again, then I roll back to the other, to the older driver. That which means you go to in, uninstall in the Windows software list and you install the other driver that you might find online or in your uh, on your download folder or wheresoever. So that's how I try to solve the problem that this doesn't happen again because it's not nice. It scares scares me out. Uh, I mean, I was just recording a lot of good gameplay and I was like, bam! And it's like, nope. This, this, the file survived, but I'm still not sure if Google, uh, YouTube, if YouTube can handle this because I couldn't play it. I could just... I just saw it's six gigabytes, so it might be that this is hanging now and it's not working at all. But I will also report about this in 
the um, video description of YouTube. So I have no idea if this will help you, the information I just gave you, but I'm quite sure that, that this this tool here, the Blue Screen Viewer, is really, Blue Screen View, is really helpful. And it helped me for other crashes as well to detect uh, the, the error, find out what the problem is. And yeah, so good luck with your problem. I hope that helps you.